And I wake up about 5 a.m. to get ready for school. And I go through all of my classes. Oh, and it missed, of course. <laughs> That's electromagnetic, so. Seven and a half. So it moved two points. Then I catch the mark train down to Georgetown. I'm a 17-year-old high school student, and I'm also a cancer researcher who focuses on cancer diagnostics. Eighty-five percent of all pancreatic cancers are diagnosed late. I was inspired by the death of a close family friend. They passed away from pancreatic cancer. They went from a perfectly healthy-looking human being into pretty much a living skeleton in six months. It was just a horrifying experience to watch, and I wanted to make sure that no one else had to go through that pain and suffering again. Armed with eighth grade biology, I set out to change cancer diagnostics. I didn't know anything about being in a lab. Yeah, I would blow my cells up in the centrifuge or overheat them. It was terrible. But in science, Failing is like one of the best things that you can do. The breakthrough moment of this entire test, that was one of the happiest moments of that entire journey. It's like a diabetic test strip, and you just take a single drop of blood or urine or whatever you're trying to detect a protein in, and you can instantly see whether or not you have the cancer. Finding out that my test strip did work, it brought to me the mind that, hey, maybe I could help save someone's life. My major goal is to save as many lives as possible and prevent the pain that comes from like pancreatic cancer as well as other cancers. Hey, Mom. Hi. 